my god, the Grim Reaper is making snow angels. I don't know if I've ever seen this before. That is really quite the sight. <laughs> I'm starting to think that the Grinch might have the right idea. Because maybe we could try to steal Christmas and then use it to get rich in The Sims. So hear me out, Stanley Humphrey, the decoration box, and that little present pile, and we see how much money we can make just from getting other people to give us gifts, and then maybe also selling some decorative reindeer or something on the side. So I guess Stanley isn't really trying to steal Christmas, but he is trying to take advantage of Christmas and use it to his benefit. I'm gonna move into Mount Komorebi because if we live up- oh, never mind, hold on. <laughs> I want to live up there. It's like a winter wonderland. Okay, here is a winter wonderland. That's fine then. We can just stay here. <laughs> Let me give him zero dollars because that's the number one goal. Oh, wait, never mind. I need a little bit more than zero dollars. I need to have a present pile and I need to have a decoration box to start out. It's not much and we also might die from the weather, but we're going to try and make it work. This reminds me of my childhood because I used to use the presents in The Sims 3 and I would throw those gift giving parties on like any day of the year for birthdays, for anything like that just because I wanted my sims to have gifts. If I'm being honest, I don't really know how this works. Like, I haven't really tried to use this as a money-making opportunity, so I don't know how many gifts you can open, I don't know how often you can open them, so I'm kind of gonna be experimenting with you here. Two robot vacuum dog? Wait a minute, isn't that like a thousand simoleons? Hello? The cats, I'm sorry, the cats are playing. Oh no, it's only 400 simoleons. Why did I get two? That doesn't feel right. <laughs> okay, I can't open one yet because I performed this action recently, but we'll see if I can open one soon. We can also rummage for winter decorations and this is almost too easy. I wasn't kidding about the reindeer. <laughs> But you just sell these and it gives you instant money. This is kind of a pro tip if you're ever struggling to pay your sims bills. Oftentimes I'll just get one of these decor boxes and then like rummage through it a couple of times because you can get a few hundred simoleons at once. All of a sudden I have $900. Like it's almost too easy. Okay, I'm gonna try this now. Can I open? Oh, never mind. Waste of money, sorry. I was wondering if the present piles counted separately. Like I opened that one, but can I open this one? And the answer is no. No, you cannot do that. What are you gonna do in the meantime? Build a snowman? Okay, you can just keep doing that if you'd like. <laughs> How many snowmen can you build before you're allowed to open another present? That is the question. Oh! me a fruitcake. See, this is actually perfect for the holiday. I really could use a toilet as well. <laughs> and we do Oh, and they left. Never mind. Okay, that's bad. Um, Stanley, should I buy him a toilet? Maybe I'll get him a pee bush. Some people from the Sims team have been repeatedly calling this the poo-hoo bush, and that is really just amazing. And honestly, not something I had considered before today. I kept calling it the pee bush or the woohoo bush. I, I never really thought to combine those things. Oh, I can open a present again. Oh, that was quick. It only took did you just destroy a snowman? Lucky man folded laundry. <laughs> What? Okay, well, I'll just keep it. At this point, it might be cute to try and build a house with- Oh, don't sabotage the decorations! Stop, 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 stop! Oh my god, he ruined Christmas. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> What's funny about that to you? The next person who opens it is in for a shock, literally. Wait, if someone else opens a sabotage decoration box, they'll get electrocuted? Hold on, is there a sim? I am so sorry. I just, I need to know. Investigate. Infer no! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh no. Now you're singed? At least you won't die from it. Although, um, <laughs> now I have a sim in my household, so something has to be done about it, and, um, I might just commit. I'm really sorry. This is, like, kind of uncalled for. I just, um, it's all in the name of science, okay? This, this sort of video, it's an experiment, and I, I have to do what has to be done so the people can, can understand how the game works. Grim, can you hurry it along, please? You're really prolonging this for no reason. Like, there's no need to delay. Okay, thank you. I'll just put that in my inventory so I don't have to see any ghosts. Oh my god, the Grim Reaper is making snow angels! I don't know if I've ever seen this before. That is really quite the sight. <laughs> wow, thank you so much, Grim. You have just made my day. I'm really, I'm really glad that that guy had to die for this. It was worth it. It really was. The Grim Reaper just opened one of my gifts. 
<laughs> what do you think he got? I don't need these little snowmen. Glimmer stone. Oh, that's a glitch because I killed the spellcaster. Oh, we can keep this. Then we have a light. Oh, that's nice. And I can open a prison again. It only takes a couple hours. It's like every four-ish hours you can open something. Fish? I'll mount it. I intend to keep that. <laughs> I think I'll build a wall. I'll put the fish up on the wall. Can I afford to build a room? Okay, I can. I think it's worth it to do that just because this is the winter. Like, we're gonna die out here if we don't try harder. All right, that's probably the best we can do. I'm sorry, Stanley. <laughs> we don't have much that we can work with right now. I would also like to get you some food. I don't know why he just keeps shoveling. Oh, a potato. Oh, Stanley, you can eat that. Oh, good. I was gonna try and go to someone's house and like steal their food. Oh, it's just one. Okay, that's not gonna cut it. <laughs> One raw potato is not really going to cover our uh, our meals for the day. Are any of you home? And also, are any of you cooking dinner? Because I would like to partake in whatever meal you are making. I might also use their shower, if I'm being honest. Let me knock on the door. I'm not going to start a break-in. <laughs> Starting a break-in to steal food is wild. Okay, no one's here. Well, one sim is here but there's no food here. And that's the bigger concern. I got in trouble for it being inappropriate. See, that's annoying. Wait, 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 he's cooking, he's cooking. I was gonna get a quick meal, he's cooking. We're fine. Okay, just stay really close <laughs> because as soon as the food is ready, we have to grab it. It's probably just gonna be a salad. No, it's a cooked meal. Ooh, even better. Hot food, a warm house, garlic noodles. Quick, quick, quick. Yes. <laughs> Well, that just made my day. Thank you very much. He's cooking again because I stole his meal. He has no choice but to cook again because he's still hungry. Oh, I just love this game. Okay, use their bathroom while you're here. It's kind of a nice toilet too. Ooh, that was like shiny. And now I'm sad. Do you think I should like let him stay sad or would it be appropriate to cheat it away? I mean, I, I did kill the sim and the sim did die in front of him. So it... I guess it makes sense that he'd be sad, but like, does he really care? I feel like at this point, Stanley, he expects it, you know? All right, let's open a gift. <laughs> what do we got next? Soul Star Athletic Poster. Oh, 610 simoleons. I'll hang it up anyway, but that's actually a really good price. <laughs> that feels too easy. You can even get lucky and get like a grill from in there. I've had that happen to me before. Of course, it's not happening right now when I need it, but I have had it happen before. I'm just gonna let him sleep until he can open gifts again. <laughs> I'm gonna keep clicking on it until it becomes time. Open present, come on Stanley. What do we got? The Slablet? <gasps> oh my God, it's a computer. <laughs> we can watch live streams. We can read books. He can play games. Oh, that just fixed everything. He is off to a really good start. It's been only one day and we've got like basically all the necessities aside from food and you know, toilets, but everything else, posters, computers, <laughs> all the good stuff. We're waking up at 4 a.m. to open gifts. Train set engine car. Okay, that's kind of Christmas fun. 450 is pretty good money. Why do people even bother having a job? If you have a whole household of people and you just keep opening presents, there is literally no need to ever work. <laughs> you can just do this nonstop. Zen again yoga mat? See, that's fun. We can do yoga. I have to be careful because if he does yoga, he might die. <laughs> He's gonna change into his athletic wear and it's like freezing outside. So he can do a little bit of yoga and then make him quickly change again. I was gonna keep this, but I probably don't need it anymore. The little pie of clothes. Oh, that was a mistake because now he's gonna freeze and I don't have a shower. <laughs> okay, wait, hold on. Freezing to death. Sorry, 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 sorry. No, wait, 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 wait. Please don't do that. It almost deleted the Grim Reaper's thing. I can't have that. Okay, so Stanley, you are going to need a shower and probably a toilet. Although I have a pee bush still, so we don't need the toilet. Wellness is rubbish. <laughs> Should Stanley dislike wellness? No, because you don't have anything else to do. You have one and only one hobby. My social is low and I have phone anxiety from fear of eviction. How do you have- Oh, oh my god. I'm using the- <laughs> I'm using an old Stanley. This Stanley has pre-existing fears from the gallery. He also has pre-existing milestones. He had mold exposure. He committed break-in. <laughs> oh, that's my bad. I I'll cheat that away. That actually shouldn't be happening. Now he's broken. Look, he won't move. No, Stanley. Fertilize. No, actually open this first. Then you can fertilize. Genius vision wall mount TV. No, you're kidding. That's a good one. $3,500? <laughs> He's got so much good stuff. Why is this present pile so good? He still might not have a toilet, but... He's got a very expensive TV. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Oh, he 
destroyed the snow pal. Oh, that's devastating. This might also be a good time to start trying to decorate the house, if I'm being honest. Maybe I should try to build up. Uh oh. Now, why did that happen? <laughs> Put my bed back. I could probably afford a fridge and maybe one counter. Not a good counter, but one counter nonetheless. And that means he can cook. And then we could also buy some sort of roof because we can decorate the roof. We can put like cute Christmas decor on there. You can't even see inside the house. <laughs> I can't afford to buy a light, so I'm making do with what I have. Let's put everyday Eve decorations. Let's get some really pretty rainbow lights or just like these cute red and green ones. No, 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 no. Why didn't those hang up up here? I want it on this part. Try these. Do the dangly ones and see what happens. There we go. Okay, that's better. That looks way better. Should we have a red front door? I guess the green one is good too. Green is maybe a little bit more unexpected. <laughs> oh, look, he's eating his first meal in his new home. Do you love it, Stanley? You're also a little bit lonely. I don't know who you can call up because most people dislike you and that person is dead. So that's not really so good, actually. Bess. Oh, I can give you one simoleon. That's fine. In the Christmas spirit, I'll give you a little bit of money. Tea magic personal brewer? Oh, that's nice. I'll keep that teapot too. We may as well. <laughs> what else are we gonna do? I need to make a friend. I need to go somewhere else and try to find a friend. Look at how pitiful our lot looks from Manage Worlds. It's actually embarrassing. <laughs> I'm gonna try and go to the park and see if anybody's there. And if I need to, I can just grill something there. Although I don't know if I have enough money to grill something. I think we have like $10 which is not, that's not gonna go far. Oh, or, or someone else can be grilling something. Oh, these people, they are like single-handedly paying for me to live. <laughs> what would I do without you? Come stand close so you don't miss out, okay? Don't talk to her yet though. No, don't distract her. She's making dinner. Here we go. Oh God, it's hot dogs. <laughs> Is that wrong? Is that appropriate? I'm being serious. I'm being completely serious. Is this cannibalism? Because the thing is, Stanley is not a man in a hot dog suit. Stanley is a hot dog. Like, he's a hot dog man. So something about this feels just deeply inappropriate, but it's too late. <laughs> He's already eaten it. It happened. Oh, this person just fell over. He probably deserved it. <laughs> he probably deserved it. I'm gonna try and grab a bunch of these servings and then see if I can just real quick bring them home with me. Our social is mostly fixed. It's also almost present time, Stanley, so you need to hurry up. Oh no, I didn't mean, I wanted you to like pick up a serving. No, no, no. Oh, he's just half eating them. Whatever, I'll just go home. You can't really steal food that easy from the park when you don't make it. I'm really hoping for a grill. I've also been given a stove before from one of these. Oh, it's an easel. Okay, that's actually not so bad. We've got a lot of useful items right now. It's kind of impressive. Uh-oh, I was going into build mode, Stanley's mid-fall. <laughs> Maybe I'll take a screenshot of that one. You look cute, buddy. It's impressive. Okay, I was gonna save these because it's quite dark inside my house. I might also save these little guys because they're kind of cute. I didn't get much else though from that rummaging. That was kind of a fail. You can just go to sleep. Tray chic perfume set. No, 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 that's a flop. No, it is $200, but it's a flop. Sapphire, no, 18 simoleons. That is ridiculous. Zen again yoga mat. How many yoga mats do you think I need? I'm one hot dog and I don't even like yoga. <laughs> I'm starting to think that I might have enough money to buy myself an actual light. I'd really like to decorate this place very Christmassy. We have these cute seasons greetings ceiling lamps, so I might hang that up. I'd like to add some more decorations outside too, like stuff that doesn't come in the decor box, things like those big lanterns and stuff, but um, we don't really have enough money for that. <laughs> I still don't have a toilet, so I probably should not spend money on lanterns. Winterfest starts tomorrow! Go away. I'm so excited. It's gonna be the best day of the year. Barely better digital camera. That's kind of a bad one, but it is a camera at least, so that's kind of cool. Do you think if I add to the present pile, it'll give me better ones? Oh, earbuds. <laughs> I'll take that money too. The fitness stuff pack is kind of dumb. Like, it's kind of a useless stuff pack, but what I will say is those earbuds do always come through. Like, it, it really ends up being a nice thing to have. I keep losing stuff. Look at how small these little guys look. It's easy to miss them when they're just sitting out there and they're also only worth 25 simoleons. So kind of a waste of my time, but it's okay. Really, who's keeping score? I'm making the house a little bit bigger because I want to have a couple more useful things. I would also like to have a bathroom. <laughs> I think that would be a nice touch if, oh, can't afford it. Never mind. Sorry. We'll just keep the shower in the middle. It's okay. <laughs> this time we're getting, <laughs> would you believe dragon? Oh, a little wooden dragon. See, that's kind of cool. You got to admit. Schmapple coffee. I don't need schmapple coffee.
comfy. I don't even have counter space for that. Who wants a, oh, whoa, that's the good one. 365, who wants a coffee maker? Like, let's be honest for a second. In The Sims specifically, nobody asked. Not a single soul is interested in that. The coffee is just annoying. <laughs> They're like constantly nonstop autonomously getting it. Your name and lights showtime award. Isn't that just a plain little lamp? Yeah, see? <sighs> We got real lucky with that TV. Things were going great when I had that TV. Is anybody just walking around? Oh, there are people over here. Okay, good, because I'm really lonely. Oh, you don't like me. Never mind. Not you. You. Kathy. Hey. I'm in big trouble, Kathy. <laughs> I'm having a real rough night. Shove snow at Kathy. No, 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 no. Kathy, 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 please, 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 please. Kathy, Kathy, Kathy. You actually can't ditch me. This is serious. Aw, they're stargazing. This is actually kind of seems uncomfortable. This sim is a masterpiece. Okay. I don't know if I want to lay on the cold, snowy ground like this, but uh, whatever. You do you, Stanley. I'm not here to judge. Oh, it's a vampire. Wait, 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 wait. Quick, 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 before he leaves. This is way better than whoever her name was. Linda? What was her name? Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> Not Linda, Kathy. That makes more sense. I was close. No, Caleb is way better. Sorry, but I'd way rather have a vampire friend. I'd even consider dating this vampire friend if I'm being honest. We can maybe try and woohoo in the bush. Hold on. Tiny home. Double relationship gain. Okay. Can I open this yet? Oh, yeah, quick open it. Then you can talk to him again. <laughs> Priorities, okay. Motion monitor gaming mat? <gasps> no, this thing is so expensive. $37.50 and you can play games on it. It might break in the snow and the rain, but it'll be okay. Attempt mistletoe kiss. Oh, didn't work. Never mind. Sorry, 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 sorry. Just leave. Just leave. Just leave. Never mind. Sorry. Sorry. Big mistake. You want to play Blick Block? Look at how cool this is. I never use this item. I think this is one of the other like big bonuses of this gift box thing is that it gives you a lot of things that you might not otherwise grab. Like there's a lot of items that are tied to it. Like this tablet. I never, ever, ever use that. The motion monitor gaming mat. I never, ever, ever use. There's a bunch of skill things like the easel and the yoga mat, but also some fun good stuff if you get lucky, like a fancy TV and then some kind of random little like decor items. There's quite a big mix of the kind of gifts you can get, which always makes it exciting when you're using it. I have literally always had fun with this thing. Every single time I've ever opened a present, I thought it was either funny or good, or I just, I always like it. It's a good time. Seasons is fun for a lot of things, but the present pile is, is kind of a, a sneaky fun addition. You wouldn't expect it to be as good as it is. Oh, there was literally nothing in the present other than sadness and lie. What was that about it being sneakily good? Are you sure? Sure, Kayla. Are you certain about that? Because maybe I take that back. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Sadness and lies. Okay. You want to try that again? Let's open it again. You can't get two bad ones in a row, right? Genius Vision wall mount TV. No way. <gasps> the same thing again? No, that just saved Christmas. We can buy a bathroom now. <laughs> We can actually have a real bathroom. Okay, I'm giving myself a bunch of extra walls real quick because I think my dream is to go through here and like really expand, maybe have some windows. We have plenty of money, so we can actually get some kind of nice stuff now. I'm willing to kind of splurge on stuff that I maybe normally wouldn't have Stanley pay for at this point, like really expensive wallpaper. This thing is eight simoleons each, but look at how cute that looks. Oh my gosh, he has a real bathroom. Stanley, I'm so proud of you. We can even move some of your furniture in inside. Like the gaming, well, that might be too big. <laughs> that might have to stay outside. There's a lot of expanding to do here. I need to do some like extensions on this house. Look at how much better it looks. Okay, then we can get some windows. These do come in red, but that in my humble opinion is absolutely horrendous. So I won't be doing that. I will just do something a little bit more plain, I think, sort of like that. All of a sudden it feels dark in here. Why does this always happen to me? I'm gonna need another light, something like that. Look at this. He's got a proper kitchen. I think I want to give him some bar stools so he actually has a place to sit. These come in red, so that kind of works for the Christmas vibes. I can use this as like a little decoration on there now. Hate the color, so I'll swap that out. I should probably also buy wallpaper <laughs> before I spend too much money on things that we don't need. Maybe I will pay for wallpaper because that would be nice to have. Can I get like a really expensive kind of ridiculous one? No, I shouldn't do that. Maybe a sort of expensive kind of ridiculous one like this. It's, it's screaming Christmas and I love it, so I'm gonna keep it. Stanley, you just saved the 
day. That was beautiful. Here, look, use your toilet. A real proper bathroom. We can even make a real proper grand meal. Let's make a ham dinner. I would like to have a Christmas tree, I think. A Christmas tree and maybe like a proper living room. Perhaps a separate bedroom would also be nice. <laughs> Couple more things on the wish list. These decorations suck. Why does it keep giving me bad ones? Oh, we need a fireplace. Wouldn't that be so good? Can you extend this out again? How much do I need for a fireplace? Ooh, I wanna have the Christmas one, which is 800. So we'll just prepare ourselves for that. Eat your ham dinner, buddy. It's gonna be okay. We'll get there. I need a fireplace so I'm ready for Santa. <laughs> you don't need a fireplace. They'll come anyway, but I want one. I feel like if we've got the opportunity to get it set up, I need to have it. Oh, the dead guy's calling about Linda. <laughs> I heard you became friends with Kathy. Yep, sure did. Hungry like the duck. Is that that little duck statue? Sneak a present. <gasps> Why wasn't I doing that all day? Of course I can do that. It's Winterfest. I'm not another team magic personal brewer. That's what I get for sneaking one. <laughs> Stupid gift. Build snow pal with Caleb. Where's Caleb? Is he gonna help me for real? No, I think it's pranking me. <gasps> Caleb! No, it wasn't pranking me. Starter herbs. Oh, please. That's offensive. Linda, please stop calling me. I can't believe he actually came. It's like a Christmas miracle. Caleb, you just made my day. Oh, never mind. He's gone. <laughs> <laughs> that was short-lived. <laughs> this random kid's helping with the snow. Never mind. <laughs> That's also short-lived. Why does nobody want to help him? Is he like non-stop bug trying to build this thing? Just give up. Oh, he's destroying that one. Oh my god. Open present. Okay, it's almost time. Santa could be here any second. Grand plans chess table? Isn't that the- Whoa, whoa. That is the expensive one. A thousand simoleons! I can buy a fireplace. Look at how pretty that looks. And my TV fits so nicely above it. And then I can just get a cute couch right here. Something like like this that could be quite Christmassy. I'll make it green. I'm gonna try and decorate real quick. This is probably a bad idea, but like maybe I could put this little guy on here instead. I have to kind of raise it up and do some sneaky things to make it fit, but that looks way better. Can I afford a Christmas tree? Yes, but I don't have space for it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can afford the Christmas tree. No, the Christmas tree doesn't really fit in the house. That's okay though, I'll move some stuff around. Oh my God, it's a miracle. This is actually beautiful. I kind of like it. I think it's really cozy, good vibes in here. And I also think that Santa comes at eight, so we should be ready. Are you going to bed? What are you doing? Oh, <gasps> Daddy Winter's here! Okay, 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 here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's introduce ourselves nicely. This is really serious. I'll give you a Winterfest gift. I got a potato, you can have one. And then I'm going to ask for a present. What, you don't care about him? Father Winter, Stanley ignores this tradition from being evil. <laughs> Oh, Santa, I bet you don't often get gifts. I know it's not like milk and cookies, but hopefully a potato will, will still do. What do you got for me, buddy? What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? What if it's cold? Please be good. Please be good. Please be good. I want a grill. That's my dream. Hello? What is it? Alcron. Is that just like a... Oh, Ten dollars! Ten simoleons? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm sneaking a present. This has to be better, right? Lyrical amplifier karaoke machine. Oh! <gasps> $2,000? Okay, Santa gives me a little $10 rock and then I sneak a present. Not sure how this thing was inside of that tiny gift box, but it's okay. Santa, do you wanna sing karaoke with me? Sing duet. Yes! Please don't leave, please don't leave, you have to do it. Oh my God, this is the best day of my life. While the shibis don't fuck round, Nubu kilka kwavu. Ipsana swoop, lona bloody jow. It actually makes me kind of uncomfortable. I don't like listening to them sing. Normally I try and turn it down a lot. <laughs> So I don't have to listen to it that loud because it's sort of like a grating noise, isn't it? Oh god. Well, are they gonna sing a whole thing? That was pretty good. Ho ho ho. You made my day. Do you think you can ask him for extra presents or no? You can fight him for presents. Oh, I can get extra. Listen, if I make him mad, it's fine. Did he just prank me? Look, you guys, what I'm about to do is really bad, okay? It's really bad and it's not right. Please, please don't do this. Do not try this at home, but I am gonna beat him up and try and get some more presents. Just for the sake of the experience. Experiment. I don't condone beating up Daddy Winter. However, <laughs> we need to know what happens if you do. It's important. Oh, I think he beat me up. Okay, that didn't go well. He beat me up. I didn't get extra presents. And now he's mad at me. Okay, big mistake. 
big mistake. Open presents with? Oh, can we do it together? Oh my gosh. I got a pile of sports equipment and then he left. Oh no. Oh, and now it's messed up. Yeah, this this day um, actually was really fun. That was some of the most fun I've had on a Sims holiday ever. <laughs> I really, really enjoyed this. This has been just in general, a very fun video for me to film. Hopefully you like it because I'm really getting in the holiday spirit right now. Also, if you're watching this in the future, I am filming this like the week of Christmas. It, it is sort of like timely. Garden friend, what could that be? Oh, it's a little bunny. I'm gonna keep it. And I would argue that this has also been one of the most effective rags to riches that we've done. Like right now, it's only been a couple days in game and our house is already worth almost 21,000 simoleons just because we've gotten so many really expensive things in the Winterfest boxes. And it takes very little effort. Like you could be doing pretty much anything all day. Normally with these hobbies that we do, it's like, okay, yeah, you can make money doing it, but you have to spend all day doing it. But with this, you can just like stop every couple hours and open in a box. <laughs> So you could be working on like painting, you could be writing, you could be like going to school still and, and make a bunch of money on the side. I'm sorry, I thought that was a lump of coal. It's heavy metal, okay? I'll put that out, that's decoration. But it doesn't require a lot of dedication from you as the player to do this as a money earning thing. So shockingly, this might be one of the best rags to riches out of all of them. Cause I guess you can make more money from a few things because this requires a lot of luck. Cause you might get 3,500 simoleons from a TV or you might get $10 from from a rock. You can't really determine how it's gonna go. Just ignore that, okay? <laughs> it's a bad Stanley. He's He's been doing other things. He's got a bunch of skills. I keep just getting him out of my library and I forget that he's the good one. Normally I use a blank slate, Stanley. But like, I see no reason to not use this gift pile. Aside from like, lack of realism, pause anonymous pets award. What's that? Oh, literally a pets award. <laughs> from owning the pets pack from The Sims 3. I don't think I would do this in like all of my saves, but I do think that I should make more of an effort to use this because I used to do it all the time for like birthdays and stuff. And I just don't really do that anymore. And I feel like I should, I should grab it for birthdays. I should get it when there's like maybe a wedding so we can have a wedding gift. Cause you can really kind of just pretend and use it for anything. It's just a magical box that spawns presents for you. You can use this in a million different ways. All right, this is our last present. What are we gonna get Stanley? Give me something good. A ceramic cookie jar. You know what? That feels kind of appropriate. It's too bad I didn't have that yesterday for Daddy Winter because that would have been kind of nice actually. All right. Well, I suppose that answers the question. Can you get rich from the present pile in The Sims 4? Absolutely yes. In fact, you're gonna have a lot of fun doing it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a fantastic method of earning money in this game. And it's a fun method of earning money in this game. So I'd highly recommend. If you don't have Seasons, I would say that Seasons is probably my favorite expansion pack out of all of them, just in general. It doesn't have a new world, so that's kind of a, a downside to it. But I would argue that Seasons makes all of the worlds feel like a new world. And having holidays and a lot of the decorations and the gameplay, it's just so fun. Like Seasons completely changes the game for me. I would have a really hard time playing without it. So if you don't have this pack, I think you might like it. And there is a huge sim sale on right now. I don't know how much seasons cost, but it's probably like one of the lower priced ones because it's old. The newer packs are more expensive when they go on sale. So consider grabbing it if you've been thinking about buying a sims pack. I've also made a couple videos ranking all of the sims packs. I should probably do an updated one because there's been like two or three packs since I did those videos, but I have made some tier lists based on my personal opinion and also like which ones have the most stuff. So if you're thinking about buying some packs and you're kind of considering which ones to get, I can link those videos down below and on the end card for you. And on that note, I am going to end this video right here. So thank you for spending some time with me and Stanley today. <laughs> Merry Christmas if you celebrate and I am going to catch you all tomorrow. Okay, bye everybody. That was so fun. I'm like kind of giggly because I had so much fun. So hopefully you liked this video because I had so much fun filming it.